Ms Ali Stegall, you've suggested uh, that you'd have trouble dealing with uh, a government led by Scott Morrison. I'd just like to ask the three members of the House of Representatives, uh, how important will be personnel in determining your choice if you face uh, a, a balance of power situation? Maybe start with you, Craig Kelly. It shouldn't be about personnel, it should be about policies. I've certainly disagreed with Scott Morrison on many issues. But I'm not going to say uh, what other may said that he should stand down or something if it's a, a hung parliament. It's got to be about what are the policies that are best for this nation. Ultimately, the Australian people will decide because the outcome of the election is the key element, how close either side becomes to forming their own majority in government, because we need stability of government. But I do have issues of trust with the Prime Minister. I've observed him over the last three years and I have repeatedly observed him fail to step up to leadership positions but also to show the adequate res necessary respect for women. I stood out at the March for Justice uh, in March last year when thousands of women around the country were calling for a more respectful environment and he failed in that test. I, st I sat there in Parliament as he talked about uh, protesters not far from here being met with bullets. I saw him absolutely sh horrendously throw Christine Holgate, a professional, a respected, a very high, highly respected uh, executive under the bus in Parliament for political gain. It was entirely inappropriate. Like the French president, I have major issues as to the style of leadership that he has allowed to develop in the current coalition. So I will negotiate with both sides and I certainly will address the policy issues Waringa wants me to take forward. But I do have questions of trust and moral compass when it comes to the Prime Minister. If I look at the debate being run out of, with his endorsement out of in Warringah currently, which is essentially a dog whistle putting incredibly vulnerable people in our community to be the fodder of a political debate completely irrespective of their safety and well-being. I do not find that to be the qualities of leadership I, I respect. I want to see this government gone and I wouldn't support a Liberal government led by Scott Morrison or by Peter Dutton. Right? I want to see this government gone. Um, Scott Morrison has certainly failed every integrity test. He has had multiple chances to show that he is worthy of this, this office and he has failed on every single occasion.